All right, so in this video, we're gonna answer why the drop service in real estate seems to be so hard for a lot of you guys, okay? I'm in Mexico right now, and I am still making a killing off of all of my drop service and properties. Why? Because they are internet-based, okay? So you can do this from anywhere to answer a few of you guys' questions. Also, so why is drop service in real estate difficult for you guys? And this is why I tell you guys to start in certain niches uh, versus others. You should start in the niches where you don't have any wait time or anything like that. Well, real estate is difficult for you guys because you're not implementing everything that I teach you inside the course. You're nitpicking and you're choosing which things you want to do, such as if I say put up a Facebook ad, most of you guys aren't. You're just waiting for uh, your ranking in the snack pack, so you can't really get upset if you're not making money immediately with drop serves. And if you choose a niche where uh, you have to wait for your Google My Business uh, listing to rank and you see the pandemic is going on right now and Google is acting very slow with the Google My Business listings, you need to learn how to pivot, transform, and, and, and adapt, okay? Like, if the snack pack isn't working naturally, you, you should say, well, what's another traffic source that I can utilize for now, okay? I know we all want free traffic. Well, guess what? I give you guys access to a whole SEO section in the school, okay? When you get in the Godfather drop service and you have the ability to rank not only in the snack pack, but organically. In the organic rankings, using press release and all of those things, those haven't changed at all during, during the pandemic or not, okay? Those algorithms still work. So it's things that you could rank for. You guys aren't ranking for the right keywords either. You're still trying to rank for stuff like realtor and all of that. Why would you be trying to rank for a realtor when you're not a realtor? You're a drop servicer or a wholesaler. You're more close to being a wholesaler. Okay, so you would want to rank for wholesalers. You would want to rank for uh, sell my house, uh, buy my house companies that buy houses in this city. All right, um, how, uh, and if you're trying to get buyer leads, homes for sale in this city, blah blah blah. I have a whole keyword research. Um, section that you guys can use to get the best keywords to rank for so that you can get these leads organically for free and everything on google but you also have facebook ads that i let you uh use my templates you can just plug them in all right and a lot of you guys aren't using that we get on the coaching calls and i ask you guys what you're doing and a lot of you guys tell me about your work schedule or or oh i just forgot or you know i've been watching netflix look it's not my business but you pay money to get into a court. It's just like people that go to college and rack up debt and they just be in the dorms having parties and stuff. That don't make any sense, man. You know what I'm saying? We not we don't we don't get younger, we only get older. So now is the time for you guys to start taking action into the things that you invest in. You invested in the Godfather Drop Service and for a reason. Now you need to be relentless. You need to be vicious. You need to be, you know, you, you can't bend to the will of your procrastination or your hesitation. Okay? So you, you gotta kill it because it only takes a few deals for your life to change, literally, all right? So if you're afraid of going all the way with these drop service and deals, you can do stuff like deal brokering, okay? You can get in a real estate revenue hacks course and you will learn deal broker, all right? Where you just get the contract and you broker it, okay? And, and you sell a contract. You don't even have to do the whole finding a buyer thing or any of that stuff. So you're not drop service and real estate right now because you're not, literally going through the content a lot of you guys when you go into a course you watch the course the same way you watch youtube you watch the video and you move on to the next section no you have to think of the courses as school i know a lot of us hated school but this is a school that can make you money at least instead of putting you in debt and you waiting years to profit you can actually make money from this school so i mean come on y'all come on man like drop service in real estate is not hard at all it is not difficult okay so what i need you guys to realize is you can do this and if you're new to this channel you need to go into the godfather of drop service and now go straight into the section where you have to pick your niche once you pick your niche you get started you don't even need a website i teach you how to uh, program automatic chatbots to you know uh do follow-up and you can do the 12 month text voice email sequence and put in a five dollar a day facebook ad and start getting deals closed okay literally five dollars a day if you guys are afraid of facebook ads just start with five five dollars a day you can always cut it off if it starts getting expensive don't be afraid you need traffic i always tell you guys traffic plus irresistible offer equals money it's not that difficult traffic plus irresistible offer equals money so this is why you guys are not 
closing these real estate deals. You're not producing enough traffic and then you need to make sure your irresistible offer is bulletproof and then you need to just go ahead and close man like the good thing is the good thing about it is in the revenue uh hacks course the real estate revenue hacks course we have multiple ways for you to make a killing in real estate it's not just drop servicing it's not just wholesaling you can start a real estate staff agency where you can it's completely hands off and realtors and wholesalers do all the work and you just get a piece it's, it's genius man so there's no excuses why you're not making real uh, real estate money so i want you guys to go ahead and take initiative and make a killing with this mug now this was not me trying to bash or or scold or anything i just want you guys to this generation is so soft man like you got to put your sensitivities aside you have to put you know, you know but what if this or what if that <laughs> you gotta put that stuff aside you gotta put it aside and kill it for your family kill it for yourself kill it for your people you know what i'm saying like for real what are you gonna do nobody cares about you except for maybe me but <laughs> the world doesn't care about you so what are you gonna do you have to have your back against the wall all right like a squirrel corner that mother gonna hop out and attack you know what I'm saying? It might run, but when you back that mug into a corner, that squirrel gonna jump in your face and scratch you up, right? All right, so that's how you gotta be with this entrepreneurship. You can't have excuses, you gotta kill it. All right, love you guys.